Hmm. <clears throat> Whoa, alright. Be careful with the lava. Don't feel like dying right now. Alright, so there's some redstone. And I think I left that there as a marker. Um, I think I already harvested some of it. Here's some more redstone. Um, and this was me getting lazy on my branch mining and just mining the top part as you just saw back there uh, Ooh, ooh. all right, so this is what I, I know this is what I did. I came down here and I grabbed the obsidian um, To make that portal That is um, All right now I'm gonna get lost. I know to make the portal that is on the wooden structure Um Come on, get around it, thank you. Do, 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 do. Nope, wrong way. Alright, so we came this way. I remember this lava. And the makeshift stairs. And we'll go this way. And I did a lot of random chaos mining down here. Saw little pockets and went for it, and it was just. It was hectic in all sense. Anything over here? No, that was that room. Anything here? Is it a big circle? Uh, nope. But I don't see anything that we can harvest. So, you know what? Let's just get out of here. I'll just craft some tools out of iron. And they will be useful enough. Let me take another sip. Let me tell you, having something next to you to drink definitely makes you more thirsty. Usually I can go through a sitting uh, without... Have any, yes, I... Oh, I did harvest them. You bum. One, two, three, four. Alright, so we got that. So... I'm gonna make some sticks. Uh, but yeah, it is weird that when you're around, um, like liquids, you just become thirsty. Oh, are you freaking kidding me? Oh, you failure. Alright, let's try this again. I want an axe. An axe. So, let's make some more sticks. And do that. And I don't really care about them. But I'll probably pick them up anyways. Alright, so, I don't care about those sticks. Oh man, it is turning night time. Oh man, another day lost. You know what? While we're here, I forgot to check, but I'm gonna grab some sandstone. And if it's not down here in my sand bucket, <laughs> um, yes, oh, tons of sandstone. Wow, nice. And that's the that's one good thing about the update um, is you can actually get that sand that sandstone slabs how would a ring of that look I'm just thinking guys so pardon me um no it's alright we'll uh do I have any wood down here that's rail. Um, should make a cake. Yeah, let's, let's take the wood. Oh, I got plenty, but um, I might need some more for what I'm thinking of. But anyways, I have no clue what I was just talking. Wow, that lighting is freaking cool looking. Um, so let's get crafting some more. I know it's going to be a little dark for you guys, but please bear with me until we get to the house. So the house is looking pretty nice. Um, definitely not hidden like I wanted it to be. Uh, but I guess when you're in town, you kind of see it from the edge here. But the mall will definitely hide it most of the time. And, who knows, I might make another character there that will totally hide it. So, we'll see in the future as this world gets expanded on. 
with time. And for a second there, I thought I had um, the difficulty set up higher than peaceful because I thought the door was a skeleton for a second there um, till I really realized that it was the door and then I did not click the difficulty off peaceful. So anyways, thank you guys. I'm not leaving at all, but thank you guys for supporting my channel. Um, you guys are freaking awesome. And the lighting in here is is decent. We need some more, so we'll, we'll get this place lit up. Um, uh, yeah, like that. That's pretty bright. <clears throat> that is pretty bright. Up here is nice. Um, yeah, I'm digging it. All right, so what we want to do is. I want to get the shovel out of here for now. I want to put my sand here. Um, and while we're here, let me craft... No, you know what? I'm going to use stairs. I'm going to use stairs for the perimeter, and then I'm going to use wooden half blocks for the little perimeter and then for my little um little little area you'll you'll see what I mean in a what the oh, I made a pressure plate you stupid fourteen fourteen grab some more wood finish this off and we'll do that alright so I know this sucks but you guys are still watching because you guys are freaking awesome um but i want to talk about hobbies what i used to do for hobbies what i do now for hobbies and what i plan on doing in the future i'm going to start off with the future i have no clue um i've always been into science and technology so i'm sure it'll probably be something along that um electronics um building stuff like that engineering stuff um not in the scientific manner of cr crafting and building but just making little things drag racers um tweaking around with motors and and, and stuff and making things seem better than they are so what we will do is this um but anyways i love science and technology um i'm trying to get into photography but digital cameras are pretty expensive when you want to do more or less like professional style um now my what i mean by that is i want i would like a digital slr i do have a traditional slr that I used in photography class when I was in high school and I absolutely loved that class. I love the fact that you can go out, take pic oh man, take pictures of just anything and most of the time it looks awesome just because you have the ability to change the focus um the ability to change the uh, the lighting um, and not that you can actually change the world lighting oh failure but that you can change the way that objects look lit up because you can change like your um, see I don't really know that I don't fully understand the technical terms but like the ISO and different f-stops on your camera allow you to change the way light enters your camera and is picked up either by the film or the digital sensor that is on the newer technology of the digital SLRs but I'm trying to learn that um, picked up I know it's not the real way to do it but I'm trying to subscribe to uh, a couple photo magazines just because the only reading that I normally get is from them uh, I definitely don't like books I never liked books um, 